Oh, you bastard. Once again, hatred for the Texas rattlesnake finally reached its boiling point, leaving the boss to search outside of his realm for a suitable ally. I resent the higher power. Who could it be? It's me. You and me, Austin. It was me all along, Austin. You all bought it. Even my immediate family bought it. But what Mr. McMahon forgot was that behind every strong man was an even stronger woman. Dad, Shane, how could you be so cruel? We really weren't trying to hurt you, Stephanie. You see, it's just business. And with the maniacal Mr. Power, the WWE Board of Directors found that they needed to do business as well, starting with a new CEO. <laughs> Nice toy. And our next pay per view event, which is King of the Ring, it will be me in one corner, and Vince, it'll be you and that little son of yours in the other corner. We take the CEO title of yours. You hang it above the ring, and the only way to reach up. Oh, a ladder match. Deal. Well, Let's go. Gentlemen, here we are. Yes, indeed. The ownership of the WWE is on the line. Oh, this could be interesting. said that he's going to fight tonight, JR. He's fighting for his business. He's fighting for his, his life. McMahon has never had a more desperate, a more serious night. Not from the federal government, not from a lawyer, not from anybody more than he has tonight because McMahon's company is on the line here. Oh, shit. Counter. Shane McMahon making his statement as we speak. This could be bad. Ah, idiot. Making his statement as we speak. Right now the momentum is with Shane McMahon and who knows when it'll stop. Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake. Pole driver. One moment of hesitation. Damn it. You can find yourself in a world The company is at risk here. The company Shit. is at stake. The McMahons could be unemployed in less than 24 hours. The future of the WWE is up in the air. Yeah, up in the air, literally. It's in that briefcase hanging <laughs> way above the ring. Remember, no disqualifications, no pinfall. Finally. It's all about the case. Winner take all. Yeah, and unfortunately, loser take nothing. Come here, Shane. After being struck like that. Grab all Vince on the stage. He's got him. Remember, there are no disqualifications in a ladder man. Oh, you fell down. Let me help you up. help at all jr mr mcmahon is cornered and a cornered man is a dangerous man dangerous enough even to beat a rattlesnake well, had <laughs> he's the one on the floor and he doesn't think so oh really who's the corporate bootlicker now oh this is a very dangerous situation jr look out so cool steve austin ladder match against both the mcmahon's Vince and Shane, Mr. McMahon, oh. and his son, Ugh. Satan, and Satan Jr. This is 
not right, Jr. Mr. McMahon's an executive. He's not made to be put through this tor this sort of torture. Oh! He is a, a demonic human being in my estimation, and Austin knows that. Austin knows his back is against the wall. The tables could turn at any time. And so oh, this is going to hit. Home Depot ah. when you need it. Clean up on aisle seven. There's some teeth on the floor, I think. And I'm afraid if Mr. McMahon's not careful, there's going to be a spill. No, this is enough, Stone Cold. Oh! Again, it's Shane McMahon being bounced around like a, a rubber ball to anything that's not nailed down. Jerry, you got to look at the look on Stone Cold's face. I think he's actually enjoying this Whoa. abuse that he's dishing out to the McMahons. Austin loves a great fight. And we know the rivalry between Austin and the McMahon. This is not a fight. It's a total beatdown with weapons, with ladders. This is not fair. Oh, my. Now what? Grab the ladder? Oh, okay. Billy pushing his opponent to the limit here. Oh, look at this. Mr. McMahon is 53 years old and in hey. phenomenal shape. Well, maybe right now, we'll see how good a shape he's in after this match. He's going for it. Oh, uh, no. Oh, come on. Vince wasn't even down this long after I hit him. Come on, Shiny. Oh, come on. Give me a break. You've been up to Titan Towers the last week with Stone Cold as the CEO. It's horrible. It's like hell with fluorescent lighting. It's not horrible. Come on. Kind of like a secretary answering the phone and saying, who the hell is this? That's a disgrace, JR. Well, King, one man's disgrace is a rattlesnake's paradise. <laughs> well, apparently, very little of this match will take place. Oh, looking to make a statement here. A perfect stunner. Oh, that hurt. Oh, we got a trophy. He's too good inside the ring to be on the floor for long. Steve Austin making his statement as we speak. Again, the ladder used as a weapon. <laughs> Get up, Vince. Oh, that's going to put an end to this one. Oh, come on. You can do it. This is... Oh, look at this, JR. Stone Cold up there. It's mine. It's mine. This thing's over. We can reach that briefcase. Whoa. Uh oh. Austin trying to retrieve the briefcase. Put the McMahons out of business as far as Shane and, and Mr. McMahon are concerned. It is a two-on-one handicap match. Anything goes. And look at this. Wait a minute. Oh, no, what's wrong with you guys? Oh, that's not going to work. That's not exactly uh, astute ingenuity. What's next for these morons? Oh, Christ. To be business this is what I loved, you know. Acting all like silly, like slapstick in a way. Double stunner! Somebody's going down. Somebody's going down. Bam! Nah. Mr. McMahon and his son Shane knocked down Austin with the with an opportunity now. Oh, stunner! Stunner! Stunners all over the place. Okay, the rattlesnake has a clear path to victory now. Austin sets the ladder. Make sure it's sturdy. All Austin has to do now is get up that ladder. Mine. I, look at this, JR. Stone Cold is climbing the ladder. Wait a minute. 
the, the, the briefcase <laughs> is ascending, as is Austin. Austin's no physical way to reach the briefcase. What's going on here? I have no idea, but that briefcase is going up down like a yo-yo. you got to be kidding me. There is collusion here. Austin knows something is screwy. I don't think that's the guy in charge of that. We certainly don't have anything to do with it. Austin. Why, Shane? Why? Kenny sees the moment. Can Shane McMahon sees the moment? Look at the McMahon family. Look at that ladder set up. Shane climbing to the top of the ladder. And look at the briefcase. It's flooring down what into the, his grasp. Where the hell's Houdini? <laughs> David Copperfield. Shane's got it. And the McMahons have returned. No. They have won the ladder match. Here are your winners. Shane McMahon. <laughs> Nothing he hasn't done worse. Oh, wait, I got that spelt wrong. <laughs> He's been through worse. Wow, we still got a lot to get through. Come on, Undertaker. Damage, all right. Just do the old attack. And Steve Austin has all the momentum here. Four, five, six. Damn it. The McMahons. <laughs> and another thing, you better start doing a little sucking up to the McMahons, or you might be out of here, JR. Well, why don't you give me some lessons? You're damn good at it. Wow, he's not doing much damage. Oi. I don't even know why Austin's still here. He was scheduled for a preliminary match tonight. He should have been a curtain jerker. Well, that's yours and Mr. McMahon's and Shane's opinion. Maybe all of us don't agree with that. Well, I'll tell you this, JR. I don't agree with that. Agree with the boss. And thank God the boss is not Austin anymore. Fired CEO that he is. Cheer up, would you? Turns it around on him and what a move. Whoop. Almost there. What in the hell is Austin doing? Austin's gonna fly. A ground heads up and dive through the air. He's in full on attack mode now. 
Yeah, I reckon if you don't reverse and it goes up, you get a signature or a finisher. Wasn't he? The shoulders are down. He's not pulling him up. Oh, the rattlesnake. Open it up a can of whoop ass on the Undertaker. Look out! Austin. Oh, boy, double close. Oh, oh, double takedown. Austin must win the WWE title, or the McMahons have decreed that Austin will never, ever get another opportunity to compete for that championship Whoa, again. Look at this. The Undertaker rising from the dead. It is a must-win situation for Austin. And look at that insidious Paul Bearer on the outside, urging his son, The Undertaker, on here. And Austin's got a win against the most oh. intimidating oh. athlete in the history of WWE, the man that's never lost at WrestleMania, The Undertaker. Undertaker with a reversal. Oh, no. Yeah, I was going to say, until now. I still can't believe that. Oh, you prick! Oh, that was rude. In the ring. And go for the pin. This guy can go toe to toe with anybody. I don't even know why Austin's still here. He was scheduled for a preliminary incredible move by Steve Austin. The shoulders are down. Two. He's not done fighting yet. <laughs> Tick. No tick. That was a ton of velocity. That was odd. It said perform a stunner and then go for the pin. Nice counter. Rinse and repeat. Oh, that hurts. Looking for all the glory here. Two. And he's got some fight left in him. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. Um. Uh, that's odd. And he threw a hard right hand there. Undertaker counters it. He's simply reminding him that he's there. Shit. Oh, that was a jackknife. Oh. Austin is the most dangerous when his back is up against the wall. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. No stamina. Get ready, folks. Get ready. Oh, out of nowhere. Steve Austin making his statement as we speak. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. Look out! <laughs> oh my! Steve Austin! Perform a stunner and then go for the pin. Stay down! Stay down! A perfect Stone Cold 
Okay. I just had to beat him. <laughs> No, it's not. You won't even have first blood matches anymore. It's too safe these days. People are afraid to get bloody hurt. Oh, he's got the bandage on his head. No DQ. I love the selling for that now. Has this been fixed? No. Uh oh. Whoop! Oh, that hurt. He wants this battle decided inside the ring. Oh, really? Bring it on. He's too good inside the ring to be on the floor for long. Oh, <laughs> Don't. Can I wedge it? I wish it could. Oh, what a battle we have here, JR. Undertaker sent for the red wall. 
Two of the all-time greats. Oh, oh bloody hell, Riff. <laughs> Stunner! No, oh, now you're fucked. Undertaker's in big... Wait, wait a minute. He has the Undertaker tied up at his mercy, as you said. But... <laughs> He's like, uh-oh. Uh, look on his face, I'll tell you that. Hey, hey, hey. Here comes Shane McMahon. Oh, Dunk. Nice try. That hurt Mr. McMahon. That's a four-bagger. They've cleaned the bases at Austin. And now he's kicking Shane McMahon out to daddy. Wow. Now Stone Cold can turn his attention once again back to a helpless undertake. Whoa, wait a minute. Whoops. And now Undertaker uh -oh. has the advantage. <laughs> Black A two by four. Mine. Oh shit. And bashes him with a chair. What a debilitating smash with that chair. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly Come on. real fast. Is it enough to put an end to this one? The Undertaker, 6'10 and a half, almost 330 pounds. Knows what is incredible move by Steve Austin. Whoa, don't get up. Go for the Stone Cold Stunner. Hey, it's black and white. Oh, blood. Oh, that's stupid. Ooh, a bit of blood. Ooh. Uh-oh. Hey, X Pac. That's random. I was going to say, what the bloody hell was that? Oh, what a load of crap. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> He's like, fuck you. And fuck you too. But not for long. 